Hello everybody, I'm back again. Um, it's been a while since I made anything, probably about a year maybe. And uh, since my last Iron Man Mark 42 build, uh, this is the Mark 43 now. And um, I wanted to share a few things with you guys on it. Um, first, here's the biceps. <laughs> Not too bad. Again, they attach with um, backpack clips. My arms are smaller than the file came out, so I put a little support there so my arm actually fits in without anything moving. And it, it works out pretty well. Um, some touch-ups I have to do. I already took this suit out a couple times to a few Comic-Con events and things. Uh, the helmet here is foam also. Uh, made everything just the same as the Mark 42 uh, just the reverse colors from the gold and the red what I noticed uh, this helmet has metal mesh in it I took out the lights and everything because I'm currently trying to put servos in there to make it motorized um, there's the hinges that I have and yeah that one came out really good right now it just opens and closes right there um, the abs here, I did not add those little round things, but I will later. Um, not bad for detailing. I didn't do too much with this one. Um, I did add in the spine detail there, so where it curves pretty well along with your spine and along with the back. Uh, the hands, I just have a tap light here. Or... Just a button there, oh. and that's how it looks. But um, after I like a while after a while, I took these out, or I'm taking them out, and I'm adding in new lights because I I didn't like how those ones came out. But anyway, the fingers are foam so that I can move and bend and everything, grab people if I need to. <laughs> um, here's the forearms of the gauntlets they attach to the the biceps there yeah and I added in this little detail it's like a computer circuit board thing from a distance it looks pretty cool I think um, and then the boots here just foam over my shoes I put my Jordans in there comfort uh, the let's see here the chest there's the neck here, um, Velcro attached on the side. Um, I didn't have a lot of tools before like I do now, so the dremeling, I added in these little details, screw details. Uh, the reactor here is just a tap light. I literally just tap it, and I had the arc reactor template pretty much just pasted over that. So you tap it on, and tap it off um, the, let's see the shoulders here again attached to backpack clips and I like the whole backpack clip system because it's just really great for mobility for me um, I'm a smaller guy so I don't know if that's like any different compared to people that are bigger than I am I don't know but yeah it just works for me uh, anyway that's how that looks Here's the back, the shoulder, um, these little inseams here are pretty great. Uh, this is where, again, Velcro and you can open it to get inside. Um, the back I did was, I think is really good. I like it a lot compared to the Mark 42. A lot more detailed. Um, this one came out great, I think. Yeah, there's more detail. Uh, there's the whole back there. And again, the neck piece. I didn't show you guys when it's outside, but you get the idea. And um, with the cod here, um, I did add in the backpack clips here and here so that I can sit down in the suit. I understand a lot of like the cosplays you can't really sit down in and it's a pain like 
over time you just get exhausted so I I made it to where you can sit down and um, these guys I had to freehand there because they're I didn't find a lot of files or anything for the actual like hip pods so I just I did the best I could with that and I went with it so it's pretty good for a quick suit um, what I really wanted to show you guys since the Avengers Infinity War trailer came out was this suit that I'm currently working on here's the back and this is the uh, Mark 48 suit from Infinity War here's the helmet there um, I just finished the biceps not too long ago uh, here's the side details um, it's not done yet so I have to finish some parts uh, reactor some details on the chest and the shoulders there um, the helmet I like the faceplate comes off too uh, just metal mesh in there and yeah magnets to keep it all together and attached and one more quick look at the back again I'm still working on it so it's gonna be a little bit but this is what I have done so far I can't wait for this one um, the person that did the files did great uh, he's the same person that did the helmet files as well so really really excited for this one anyway uh, there's a few more projects that I have or working on yeah anyway that's it I just wanted to show you guys um, happy holidays Merry Christmas um, and I will see you later. Bye. There's Bentley.